Yeah. Hey guys, Spray and Pray here, and welcome back to the latest episode of my Let's Play of Victoria 2. As Hyderabad, we were playing in the Ultimate mod, we were going to form the Ultimate India. Uh, unfortunately, last episode, I think as I discussed, we have hit a little bit of a bump in the road regarding forming India, because we need to be able to colonize this island, but we're not going to be able to do that until, like, I don't know, uh, the 1800s about, so we have a long time until we can actually even do that, unfortunately. However, in the meantime, we are going to just satisfy our lust for conquering and becoming things by conquering these uh, China in southern Asian provinces. Like, for instance, we're going to in integrate Dainam very shortly. Um, we are an international pariah, so hopefully we can ride out that event. Uh, all right, I believe the international pariah thing goes for a pretty long time. But as we're able to fight off all the great powers, which is, should be pretty easy, because I'm pretty sure we are the greatest military power in the world. Um, the only other military power that we can even think about is maybe Slavic Empire, and they've always been our friend. But of course, you know, they kind of hate us now. But that's okay, <laughs> because, uh, yeah, well... We are allies, that's good. Right? It says call ally? Oh no, they, they definitely broke that. Alright, good. I was making sure, because I was like, wait a minute, I hope they didn't. I hope they broke our alliance, because that would be bad if they didn't. Anyways, onwards. Alright, we got a bunch of troops being produced in China, that's just fantastic. We've fully gone, broken ourselves up, and taken over almost all the regions that we need to. We can now create a bunch of protectorates down here, which is going to be cool. Alright, and we can even go further into these zones, which I definitely will, because why not? And we might as well justify war to protectorize the Zulu. Alright, let's see if we can't build any more army in Africa. All right, that's going to work out good. We're losing money, though. That's not good. So let's see if we can't fix that. I like how you can just, like, lower this, but it's like it doesn't really do anything. Oh, that actually is a lot. Yeah, but unfortunately, we're going to have to make money some other way. Wow, we have so much mill tax tax. Let's see if we can't get away. Uh, I don't want to do that. Let's, um... Right, we need to make another $200. Um, the best way to do that is probably going to be just lowering this $200 for right now. Why are we not making enough money? I don't get it. Are we going to make money now? <laughs> there we go. Um, I'm going to ignore those, like, you can create a colony thing, because it's going to eat up more of our points than I'd like. All right, we're going to keep these guys down here, because they're going to be the ones sieging. Um, can we get any more troops on this boat? Uh, tensions with Portugal assert our position. I mean, whatever, we already have so much infamy, it's not like one is going to make a difference. So Burma, can we add Wargul to you? Demand, um... Alright, so where's your capital, Burma? That's the first thing I want to know. I hope it's not an, an annoying place. <clears throat> like, uh, it would be sucky. Oh, Rangoon! That's where all the crabs come from, right? No. Okay, so it is an annoying place. In an annoying place. But if we take Kachin, then that's all we really need. So let's add, uh, this for Kachin. Okay. Thank you. We'll move out of Crab Rangoon. Uh, lazy natives. No consciousness, please. Thank you. So yeah, we've taken over South Africa. That's pretty rich in. And we're going to get up a little bit further up here, too. Okay. Okay, they only have two, three, two, two provinces, so we're going to just take them over. OK. 
Okay. Um, let's take these guys home. And maybe we should stop making more troops. Lazy. Oh wow, that's actually so nice. Look at how much money we're making now, guys. Shit. Okay, that's never mind. Put that back. Never mind, I want to make money again. Back down. 10%, sounds good. Ooh, yes, dig deeply and greedily. Yes, please. When can we create this protectorate? In 1718? Um, 226, so like right now. There we go. All right. Let's see, how's our navy bases down here? Why can't we build them? What the fuck? I don't think I have enough money. Yeah, that's why. Alright. Uh, dry spell, farming efficiency, the rain will fall sooner or later, or we... Uh, okay. Hmm. Yeah, save even more water. Let's do that. Alright, and I'm pretty sure we've gotten all the colonies that we can get for right now, so we might as well hit the button now. Alright. Lazy natives. I'm gonna build a... I'm gonna build a uh, navy base here. And now we're going to try to repay our debts, because I'm pretty sure, don't we have, yeah, we have a bunch of interest now. Well, not really a bunch, but a good amount. Alright. Militancy sounds great. How close, uh, 21 is when our truce is up, so we, we have a little bit of time to worry to about them anymore. Um... All right, Burma. Since we we might as well add the other war goals though. Just because we're gonna get the score, we're gonna get the reset anyways. Who are we at war with now? Oh, the Zulu. I forgot about you. Yeah, their sieges are coming along. I wonder if this is why we're taking so much shit, is because of all these troops, like, killing themselves. I hope not. What does this, what does this mean? Pop too small. Okay. That's fine, and I think that's a good amount to leave behind. Uh... All right, Burma. All right, and you too, Dynam? Oh, you don't want to give me everything I'm asking for. Why not? What else is there? <laughs> okay, well, I guess we're getting our score over time. Um, you have some sort of blockade, it says? Where be that? Oh, right here. Okay. Uh, let's see if our 30 ships can take care of that. Uh, okay. Wow, why are we making all... It's so weird how the money just, like, jumps like that. Skim? What happened to Skim? Why am I just now hearing about this? Why Why is it telling me now? I've always had my influence for them maxed. Oh, I think it's because we, oh, we were trying to, yeah, all right. When we keep getting banned, all right, I get it. So, uh, Dynon, you ready? No. Okay. That's 
how you want it. Let the farmers keep the tea or whatever. Do not westernize, please. I beg of ye. How's the uh, western heavenly kingdom? Their truce is ending on the same day, November 3rd. All right, well, we only have two more years, so hopefully they don't westernize before then, and we'll be all right. Dynam, Annex Dynam. There we go. Perfect. We're at 104 infamy. And we're making a buttload of money, and our name is pretty cool now, because we've taken over all that stuff from Burma. Um, hey, Siam. Just wondering, um, can we do a... Uh, no, we can't. We can't conquest you outright. That sucks. How's Jahor? Has these things turned into gold yet? No. But they will, right? They Don't they turn into gold at some point? And why is Cambodia free? What the hell happened? Hmm. Alright, well, anyways, that, that Dynam is great because of all the ports that you can make there. Okay, so expand the port, expand the port, expand the port. And these ones we got from Burma. Expand the port. Expand the port. And we gotta forget about that one. I forgot about that one. Alright, that's great. Now we have all these awesome ports. We're gonna be able to get more colonial points. Sweet. Uh, never. Uh, do it. The Kingdom of England joined us. We shall be victorious. Okay. <laughs> we shall see about that. Uh, so what's this? How much military do they have? 69? The Slavic Empire has 92 military strength. That's kind of scary, but... I mean, especially it's especially scary that we're not paying for it. Come on. Who? Kamancharia? Is that literally one of the... I'm pretty sure that's one of these guys right here. Holy crap, you're a great power? Because you have 45 prestige? Damn. You let anybody be a great power, huh? Oh well. We kind of just have to chill. Ah, oh, good, we can do something to Portugal, finally. Yay, I'm friend- oh no, Spain actually is Spain now, the other Spain flag. Okay. Um... I fail to see... any... danger. I'm really actually afraid, because, I mean, this war... <laughs> Not the creek! Okay, I'm pretty sure all the great powers are at war with us now. Um, Japan, great total of zero. Slavic Empire, 94. France, England. England's in our sphere, that's hilarious. Um, France, yeah, I don't think... I doubt we'll have to worry about them coming over here. Um, but in the what we can actually do to France is... Uh, France is what the one I'm most afraid of. France and maybe the Slavic Empire. Just because they're so close. And those are the only guys with actual military strength. But uh, what we're going to do is we're going to just siege them. <sighs> Not Ireland. Oh, Jesus. Okay, never mind. I surrender. Undo everything. Release all my conquests. Alright, let's see if we can't get a good amount of people together. Intervene eventually. We're going to just merge our... Okay, Spain, really? Really, Spain? We're gonna try to merge these guys into like actual workable armies. Let's see, where's the supply limit mode? Alright, that should be a good army. Ok, 
Okay, where's these guys? Okay, so this army... Japan made an army? Holy shit, what the hell? I thought they had zero. Ooh, ten. We should invade Japan, just for the fucking fun of it. Alright, alright. We have our boats here. Let's go invade Japan. Let's see. So 30 times 3 should be, um, like, 90. So let's... We can probably carry all these guys. Whoa. That's not good. Alright, let's get these guys over to Japan. See, we're gonna make more money that way, so we'll might as well. Um, I believe we can repay all of our loans. So we'll do that so we don't have any more interest building up while we make a little bit of money. Alright, these guys get on the beaches of Japan. Yeah, we don't need to be taking 7% attrition. Thank you. <laughs> Okay. And we are gonna peace out Japan. Hopefully that means quick. That's gonna be quick, hopefully, because of this occupation. So we got Bourbon. Oh, it looks like France is coming to play. Hi, France. How you doing? I see you didn't want to attack anywhere else. Oh, Ireland! Ireland, even everybody's playing now. Why? <laughs> Leave me alone. I just... I was, I was like, oh, I wonder when Naj is going to play one on me, because I saw that they were a great power. Um, yeah, but I'm pretty sure we can just ride it out. Um, defender blockades, attacker blockades. Yeah, so none of these wars are doing much. Okay. Um, and then we should get... what's our... what's the war goal? Let's see. I think the only thing that they can get war goal... like war goal score is for, um... for if they own, like... I think they have to own... oh, whoa, 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 whoa. I think we can zerg them, but I hope. Can we afford to pay for our army all the way? How much money are we losing? Not much. Drop that. Drop, raise that. I mean, it's doable. Why am I losing money? Oh my god, I hate... Oh. Come on. Come on, game. Alright, we were getting better tariffs at um, 20%. So let's, let's try this again. <laughs> okay. Okay, fuck, where the hell is this shit going from? Alright. So where are we getting invaded by Russia? Oh, 
Okay, there's where we're going to be by Russia. Alright, so we can afford to spend another hundred. Right? Okay. Let's pull these guys back. Alright. Because this is going to be a pain in the balls. I can't believe... Why are we losing money? I don't understand. Like, for real. Alright. So we can now do another... How's that? Alright. One, two, three... Four, five. Okay. Pretty sure that's all we can afford. Um, but we should be able to. With this army, we should be able to beat up those guys. Okay, we'll move in over there. Yes. Oh god, that's gonna be weird. Wow, they all fit. Seriously. Damn. Okay. Now we're gonna drop these guys on there. All right, we got the Zuli. Alright, and here comes the rest of our troops. We got a little bit more stuff. We have no loans right now, so I wonder... Would it be worth taking out a few? I, I don't... I, I'm very, very unfamiliar with how the whole loan thing works with uh, regard to this game. So, oh god, there's so many troops over there right now. We need to definitely take out loans. Alright, max, max that. Alright, we're gonna just pay for our troops and deal with the consequences of going into debt, I guess. Because there are a lot of pissed off troops over there. Okay. Let's balance these bitches. And we're gonna just carpet siege Japan. Oh god, why did I hit that button? <laughs> They look so similar, and they're like in the same place. The whole uh, the split unit and uh, combined unit button. That's why I hit it. All right. There, 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 and there. Where is this army headed? Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, there it is. I was like, where is this? Uh, I thought they had a huge army down here, and where did it go? I don't see it. Looks like Japan has been foiled. Yeah, they're not paying for their troops anymore. That's good news. For us. Alright, let's see. Uh, Japan, do you want a piece? Yeah, I'm not going to do the whole dismantling my empire thing. Uh, I'm going to disband all those units, because we weren't going to be able to use them anyways. Alright, let's see if we can't win some minor battles over here. And then I, I'm just going to make sure that we don't have any other any other issues. Hostile occupation. Okay, so we got a little bit of hostile occupation going on just on our colonies, though. And they're not actually landing anywhere. I think we're going to disband these guys as well, just so that we don't have to pay for them. 
And that should work out better. We're actually making a little bit of money now, that's good. And we can maybe influence... Oh sweet, check that out! We added Portugal to our sphere. Isn't that nice? Uh, let's see if we can get them to attack us here. They are. They're going to attack us in Bela. Let's stay there. Why? What are they doing? No. You idiots. Alright, we're going to go all in here. Whoa, 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 whoa. Please win. Why? What happened? Why are they not going? Oh my god, I told you to fucking go! Oh god, tax protests, really? Come on. We just got our shit together, and you're gonna protest to me like that? I hate this game. <laughs> I hate you guys. You guys suck. Mmm. Why are they defeating us so easily? Like, come on, I'm paying for all my units. What makes you guys so special? Oh, we won? Well, oh, thank God. Let's retreat to Karach. We'll send one army. Oh, I don't want to go up there. So let's see, who are we hurting the... Well, let's just take a look at the arm, the wars here. Um, Slavics are 5%, so 4%. Come on, Japan, you really you want to... You don't, do you really... You want to peace out? Come on. This war has been going on far too long. Ugh. Why are we losing? <laughs> I don't know why. Why, game? Why do you hate me? I just like that Russia is not coming into my territory. As much. Why are they not taking attrition is what I want to know. I mean, shouldn't they be taking like 2% attrition or some dumb shit like that? Anyways. Um, shit, let's see here. Split this. I'll send some transports just to maybe go get some easy war score against them. Um, actually, we could probably use these troops over on the continent. Let's grab a. Let's send some troops down there. But see, like, I don't. I hate how this attrition is just like murder on us. Like, I already lost really five percent attrition. Are you kidding me? It's ridiculous. That's so high. <sighs> the only thing I like is that they're dumb. They're so dumb, they're not like even attacking with everything. So that's my only like little concession that they give me. All right, let's go and uh, pick up the other the other army over here. We're gonna go crush them. Oh fuck their navy. Oh, I think I know why they're not okay. I guess that sort of makes sense. Why won't they give me military access, Moogles? You're in my sphere, you should give me whatever I ask for. Well whatever, I'm not gonna attack them in the mountains. F that. Oh, lazy natives. Gonna drop off more troops over here. Hmm. 
I'm just gonna attack them. Okay. I don't want to fight them in the mountains if we can avoid it. Where, where are these guys going? They're not going to where we are, so that's nice. <laughs> Leave me alone, you bastards. Alright. Hello. We beat them in the gulf here. No, not Persia. Persia was... I didn't even know they were in our sphere. <laughs> We need to win some battles against the Slavics. They're going to Quetta. Okay. Well, if that's where they're all gonna go, I guess that's good. Um, the war against Japan continues. I think we're gonna leave them alone. I don't, I don't really see any benefit to it so far. Um, maybe, no, I'll send one fleet back and then we'll have this other fleet defend us over here because I really, I don't want to see any more French troops just magically appear. Uh, Alright, hostile occupations. Oh, hi France. I mean Spain. That's fine though. The Spain, if they're going to attack there, I'm pretty sure we'll be able to get white peace if we just kind of chill for a few minutes. All right, we're gonna just blitz them now. All right, we can go push these guys into the corner up there. And we're gonna go after them. Xinjiang, we gotta repay debts on them. No thanks. All right. We won the, war, the Battle of Bella again. Let's get up here and uh, take over. Uh, take, retake our provinces that we own. Lazy natives again. Kill them, please. Kill them. Thank you. Alright. Reform the border. Whoa, hey, hey, whoa, whoa, hey. How did we lose? We had like twice the amount of troops. <laughs> okay. Okay. I guess. All right, let's get these guys home. All right, actually, you guys come out. Uh, we're gonna break off just like uh, five ships, so that the Japs can't move around anymore. All right, that's fine. We didn't get everybody, but that's okay. We got plenty of people. Alright, these guys are going where? They're going to Kalat. Alright, they're going to stupidly attack us in the mountains. Please, dear God, allow me to crush these guys up here. And reinforce in time over here. Alright, we got them right on the day that they attacked. Please, dear God, don't let us die. Intervene immediately. Okay, we won the Battle of Kalat. That's great. All right, how many troops do we have left? 5,000? Are there any more coming? No. Okay, good. We've successfully turned them around. That's great. We wasted our siege progress, though. That's fine. We're going to get back to Quaita. Um, There's 10,000 troops coming back to attack us again in the mountains. Although I think that's probably going to be a bad idea. Yeah, look at that. We won. Thank God. Holy crap. <laughs> All right, this is like so intense, Jesus Christ. Um, I'm sweating. <laughs> okay, uh, let's go siege up these things just because they're not, they can't get there. I'm pretty sure this uh, Seto Inland Sea is the one that's blocking them from being able to go around here. Um, okay, um, let's also go to Nagasaki. 
Oh no, let's go with this guy's there. Yeah, that's fine. All right, so that's gonna about do it for this episode, guys. I hope you enjoyed. Um, oh, it looks like Yunnan did westernize, and so did China. Um, we totally missed the, our chance to attack them again, but um, yeah, they're uh, they're a great power now, so that's actually kind of scary. They haven't declared war on us yet, though, so that's nice. Um, if they do declare war on us, I'm pretty sure I'm just gonna be like, okay, I kill myself, I die. I dead, I died, I dead, I died. But uh, at least they're not allies to each other. And uh, it looks like Gung Shui here. We can like justify war to take over, to conquest them, actually. So we'll probably start doing that just so that we can get that over with. Um, they don't have any allies, right? Right, 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 right. Yeah. Okay, they're allied with Gung Shui, but I'm pretty sure that's uh, this one up here, which is a lot of population. Actually, they have a lot of military power just for them being so small. <laughs> Anyways, thanks so much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed. Next time, China. And uh, we'll finish up these massive wars that we're in right now. See you then. Spring Prey out.